so it's bulk season. Yeah. Right? Yeah. You're getting big, man, yeah, right? Yeah, I'm working on it. Right? Uh, what did you weigh? Obviously, 49 to last day, uh, NCAAs, you made 49, right? 50, 50. right? You made 50. Yeah. When was the last time you weighed 50? That day? Well, oh, yeah, yeah. No, no. Yeah, I'll never see 50 again. That getting was the big. last time I saw it. But getting big, right? Before that day, well, before the season, I hadn't been. I guess I wrestled juniors at 145, but that was it day before weigh-in, so that's a little different. But other than before that, I hadn't been that low since I was a freshman in high school. Wow. Wow. So what's the plan for the upcoming season? Move up. That's, I mean, North graduates, and I think it works out for our lineup, and it works out for me, too. I get a rest yeah, I feel a lot better. It's an injury default. So do you think you're going to wrestle at U23s? Yeah, I mean, might as well. Yeah, for sure. Why not go win a world title? It's always fun. I love going overseas too. It's just different, different culture, different competition. I always feel like I get a lot better just training for it, first of all. And second of all, being able to get that different feel um, overseas with those guys. And the more experience I get at this age, and the more prepared I'm going to be when I get older. So usually this would be considered the off season, but you know, you're in a room where, where guys are training for a senior world team. Yeah. What's it like being around that? Oh yeah, it's, it's awesome. Um, especially right now, the intensity, you can just kind of feel and picked up. Um, obviously, they're peaking and getting ready, but um, you can tell when they walk in, those guys walk into practice, when Zane walks into practice, he's dialed in and he's ready, he's ready to go. So yeah, I've, it's, been a, it's been a great experience and I enjoy it every day. When you look at the training, you know, cycle, you guys have so many good foreigners in the room. Um, yeah. You guys come, it's crazy, right? Yeah. The Indian Line Wrestling Club yeah. it is, you know, the feels that you get. Uh -huh. For example, how you just finished that match. Yeah. Double overs. Yeah. For a big honest, throw, right? You, yeah, it was, and I don't do that. If you go and watch my past wrestling, you rarely see it. And I had another big throw earlier in the tournament, too. And I don't, it's just the, like you said, I get to wrestle with a bunch of different, different guys in our room. and. I guess one thing I've learned is, especially watching some of our really good guys, for like Bo Nickel, for example, is when you get in those positions, you take advantage of it. Why not? I mean, it's just wrestling, so if you end up getting scored on, who cares? You get back up and you go score the next point. That's the way I look at it now. How oh, will uh, past world championship experiences help you this time around? Yeah, um, a lot. And when I went to juniors last year, that was my second time competing overseas. I was with cadets, and I learned a lot from my cadet. I was I was nervous going to cadets. Um, then everyone, when I was training, everyone's like, "Oh, they got this weird feel. You got to do this. You got to do that." And then when you go over there, they do have a different feel, but it's still wrestling. And that was one thing I took into last year's tournament was, it's just wrestling. So I'm just gonna go score points. And yeah, I, I lost to that Russian last year at juniors. I learned a lot from that match, and I ended up bouncing back and winning a medal for USA, which was, which was pretty cool. The 60 kilo fourth place medal here. Today. No high pressure approach for you know Penn State. It's kind of like laid back, yeah. loose. How much does that help you that there's not a ton of pressure on you and you can yeah. just go like it's wrestling, right? Yeah. It's just wrestling. Well, yeah, for sure. And you know we do this sport because we love it and we live for these moments, right? We live for moments to go compete overseas. We go compete for a spot on a world team and go win a national championship as an individual and as a team. And that's one thing that I'm, I'm still learning and I'm getting a lot better at is when these big matches come, it's like, I live for it, right? I live for it, I want to be in this position. I don't want to I don't want to not be in this position. I don't want to have an easy road, no way. I want to be at wrestling the best, why not? It's fun. But yeah, no, no, it's definitely. The pressure is definitely, it's, it's not on, we just enjoy it, the P-Hard. Congratulations, man. Thank you. Appreciate